Amy Schumer, 36, left little to the imagination during her R-rated toast at the premiere of her new film, I Feel Pretty on April 17. While celebrating the film, which hits theaters on Friday, April 20, Schumer thanked her new husband Chris Fisher, 37, in the best way possible. I want to thank my husband Chris who is here. Thank you for having sex with me, she said, as the packed crowd roared with laughter, adding, and for loving me. The comedian then gave thanks to her co-star Rory Scovel, who plays her on-screen boyfriend in I Feel Pretty, Rory. Thank you for pretending to have sex with me in the movie, Schumer said, spoiler. Schumer, who wrote, directed and starred in the forthcoming comedy, looked stunning at the premiere, which took place at the Westwood Village Theater in L.A. Fisher was by her side on the red carpet, dressed in a black suit with a white undershirt. Schumer and Fisher surprised everyone when they revealed that they had gotten hitched in a surprise ceremony on February 13 in Malibu. She posted photos from the wedding on her Instagram page days after, writing, Yup. The ceremony took place at a private home overlooking the ocean. Jennifer Lawrence, Jake Gyllenhaal, Jennifer Aniston, Larry David, Judd Apatow, and David Spade, attended the ceremony, according to reports. I Feel Pretty chronicles a woman named Renee Bennett, played by Schumer, who struggles with self-image insecurity and confidence on a daily basis, but in a comedic nature. However, when she wakes up from a fall, she suddenly believes she's the most beautiful woman, who can do anything, while at the premiere, Shum revealed why the world needs a film like I Feel Pretty. We want women to feel empowered, we don't want anything to hold them back, she explained. If you feel someone is going to insult you, call you ugly or fat, it holds you back. I don't want anything to keep women from their full potential. I feel pretty, which also stars Emily Rotikowski, Michelle Williams, Busy Phillips, A.D. Bryant, Naomi Campbell, and Olivia Calpo, hits theaters this Friday.